Historically, our industry hasn't had a lot of tertiary education involved. Thankfully, now we've got a Bachelor of Business in Property Economics, which I think is outstanding. And I'm seeing more and more young individuals get into that space and therefore, once they graduate, be able to do either commercial real estate, residential real estate, valuations, project management, project marketing, whatever the case may be. So the discipline of actually completing a degree, I think is absolutely critical. So the gap I found in the market and especially being a coach and mentor to a lot of developing agents, even business leaders who haven't had a lot of coaching in terms of PL statements, running a business and human resources, marketing, etc. I've had the opportunity to be able to sit down with these individuals and mentor them around what profits look like, what running a business looks like, what growth is, but not growth for growth's sake. So mentorship can sometimes replace place tertiary education. Ideally, we have a hybrid of both. And I feel that that's the way the industry is currently heading more towards a industry and a career that people just don't fall into like I did and many others of my generation, but actually strive for when they're in year 11 and 12 and see that university degree with property as something that is highly valued and could lead to a career and an income that's equivalent to barrier barristers and surgeons. So I would highly recommend having both virtual mentors through listening to podcasts and audiobooks and reading books and also face-to-face -face mentors if you can get a hold of them. And I find that people that are very successful are extremely generous with their time, especially in the real estate industry where other industries, people don't share any of their IP whatsoever. So if you're after some mentorship, reach out, look at my website, adrianbow.com, all the options are available.